the nose comes up. This is the Beechcraft Defense Systems T6 Texan II, named after the Texan World War II. The Texan trainer, the advanced trainer that serves in the United States Army Air Force. So the United States Navy. Mike, game show Rambo. Two points of a vertical roll with a negative G pushover. That's where things get a little uncomfortable. When you feel like you're gonna get tossed out of your seat. Straight down. Two points of a four point roll. Finishes off that one. Now we've seen a couple of four point rolls. We're gonna get to see one now as game show does a couple of rolls to the inverted and performs a reversal turn called a split S, or half of the vertical S. He'll set up for the four-point hesitation roll. This is powered by a Pratt & Whitney Canada PT6 turboprop engine. Watch for the nose to come up. the slow roll. This looks so easy, but I tell you, it is one of the most demanding control and stick and rudder controlling maneuvers. This is the super slow roll. And game show keeps the line going just... Textron family of products, Beechcraft Joint, Cessna, Bell Helicopter, Textron, Airland, TRU Simulation and Training, and others to provide aviation and defense products known around the world. The Texan II is flown by nations around the world and provides military students an advanced platform to learn everything from the basics of flight all the way through advanced training in aerobatics, instrument flight, navigation, and formation flying. In addition to the United States Air Force, Navy, and the Army, the Texan II In World War II, they called it the Harvard back then, so they call it the Harvard II now. It's been chosen by the forces of Greece, Israel, Morocco, Iraq, Mexico, as well as New Zealand. The T-6 is featured as part of the national demonstration teams of Israel, Mexico, and soon will be the New Zealand demonstration team aircraft as well. Of the 900 T-6s, that have been built, almost 500 have gone to the United States Air Force and 200 to the United States Navy. It's a jet engine that turns a propeller. Knife edge flight. So get the cameras going. I think what he's going to do now is come in from the right, roll the airplane on its back, and then give a little wing wag with the stick to salute all of you who are here today enjoying the show. This T6C Texan II is the only one that's actually outfitted with anti-skid brakes. It's the only one in the world. And it soon will become part of all of the T6. Nope, he's going to do something. He's got a little more time. Quickly, he climbs to over 2,000 feet above the ground. Rolls it over. Tilt his head back. 
look at the runway and pull that stick back into his lap. Pull it back on the throttle in his left hand, stick back in his right hand, pull back, comes down. And we'll see another chance to see the Beechcraft brand. The knife edge pass bottom. Side.